All right, guys, welcome back to some more Sniper Ghost Warrior 3. Now, this game actually kind of caught me off guard. Um, I did not expect it to be as awesome as it is, being as we, we played the first two um, Sniper Ghost Warrior games, and they were quite, like, they were they, they were cool. They, they Trust me, they, they were good, but they were more, like, linear story based like missions um you'd kind of just go through like a very linear map and you'd have certain areas this is like somebody p actually uh broke it down perfect this game is like if ghost recon wildlands and far cry had a baby you would you would end up with this game that's like the best way to explain it um but welcome back guys we are here um we already did quite a few missions last episode uh, i took out some of the wanted targets we have one more left that's over here but we're not going to worry about that right now uh let's see let's see let's see let's go check our computer and see what we have in in the shoot right now all right so flying sparks is our next the separatists are trying to restore a rail transfer route connecting strategic military locations we can't let them gain that kind of mobility recover a transport manifest and destroy the depot uh intel suggests there are enough immobilized tank cars on the site to burn the entire operation to the ground okay um all it takes is one spark your first objective is to infiltrate the main depot recover the manifest and then blow the damn place let's do it guys increased chatter about this rebuilt rail transport hub key strategic location to widen the separatist reach gives them agility and increased strength capacity any intel on that special payload they're expecting no just that it's a game changer that's why we need you to infiltrate the yard and get the shipping manifests we need to know who's shipping what and why. Damn. I was hoping for fireworks. Well, Intel says the Separatists have been stockpiling fuel in a load of on-site tanker cars. Enough to send the whole rail yard kaboom. Ah, well, that would do in the fireworks department. All it takes is a single spark. And you, pal, are a fucking blowtorch. I'll do my best. Out. All right. But I appreciate you all for coming and hanging out. So no motion, um, the first 15 seconds of the video aren't cut. It's just if you're watching live, um, you probably got an ad at the start when I went live. So when the ad cuts out or whatever. Uh, but if you go back and you watch any of my videos, the intro is there. It's just something to do with the live. Oh, I'm not playing Hell Divers, no. Uh, cut around this way. Yeah, everybody uh, has ads on YouTube for the most part. There's, it's not like Twitch where if you're like a subscriber or whatever, um, it's like ad free. That's not how YouTube works. Hey, Doom Slayer, hey, congrats on that, man. This is a hell of a drive, I'll tell you what. I'm gonna check the sat map here and see. Uh, Water. See if we can get eyes on what this area looks like. Okay, so I actually thought this was like an airstrip, but now I can see a definite train yard. Um, so if anything, we could take the road up here, try to get up on this, like even this camel trail up here, see if maybe gaining elevation will allow us to see down. Oh, we're gonna have to go on foot. They got a guard tower. 
two guard towers actually kind of looking up this way. You got guys at the gate. So infiltration first. Then we'll worry about turning this place into a giant fireball. Let's get the drone up in the air. Okay, we got a guy, a sniper in that tower there. Yeah, we can put some work in from this area. I don't know if those are civvies or... Yeah, I think they're civvies just working. Right, so we're going to have to deal with the sniper in the tower. Blocked by a damn pole. Might still be able to get the kill though. He's 98. We'll range out to 100. There it is. That guy's not a sniper, so we don't have to worry about him. I'm on site. Over. Good. The manifest should be in the main depot. Well, shit, we probably could have just climbed up here behind that sniper, but... Now we don't have to worry about him. Okay, so main building's over there, crossed. But I want to get up here. I want to scout. We'll come up with a way that we're going to make our, uh, like, a path that we're going to go through. Civvy? Nope, those are baddies. So that's our target building. Um, obviously, we got that group on the right side here. So our best bet would be probably to try to sneak up from this side. Got this guy up top here, but I think we might be able to make our way around him. I might have to drop him, though. Is that what? 165? I don't know if dropping him from here right now would be ideal.
Oh, I, I didn't even pay attention to the windage. Got him the follow up shot. I think we're good. Okay, we're good. We got a sniper position up there. Oh, God damn. Four civvies there. Okay, we're gonna have to go wide and come around that backside. Get a little closer before we hit this other guy up on the uh, overpass. Chip, everything is good, man. Uh, Dracker, hey, the, 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 actually, I ran into some copyright issues, man, with Final Fantasy VII. The, the whole first stream is so fucked, dude. It's ridiculous. Um,. I don't understand why, because it's just like normal. Like I, I went back and checked. It was just the normal in-game music, dude. And I was like, the whole stream is literally just copyright. 215. But that and it didn't do very well. Got him. Yeah, the music, I, I, that caught me off. I, I got hit with that this morning. I was like, what the fuck? What the hell? Where'd all this copyright come from? Um, so I was like, this is, and then I went back and I, ooh, and I listened to it and it was just the in-game music. And I was like, why is this copyright? I played the first game and had no issues with copyright music whatsoever. I think there's a group of baddies over here. Lead back with the 11 months. Thank you so much, man. 
Dodge, I appreciate you for popping in. Gotta be careful in these little corridors like this. Cause I didn't like super, super thoroughly scan with the drone. So there could easily be guys still around. If I would have known, I mean, if I would have done my freaking recon proper, I would have known that our objective building was on this side and I wouldn't have, I pushed up there cause it was good elevation, good way to scout the area but it also put me on the complete opposite side of the objective building, which kind of sucks. So then I had to make my way all the way back down. Cities. Only thing is this guy in a tower there. I don't think he's gonna look back this way, so we should be okay. I hope so. See my new trains? No, why? There's so much. They they might snitch on me still, so. Clear for now. Got the manifest. Copy that. Now dump the fuel from those tanker cars. Is that pin, dude? Nothing on State of Decay three, nah. Trust me, when 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 there's news on SOD three, I don't think you lose any ammo, melodic. No. See me right now. Okay. 
Okay, I'm releasing the fuel. Released the second valve. Things are going to get really hot once you light the fire. So be damn sure you're away from there when you strike the match. We go we can go back up on top up here. FX Gamer, what's going on? Hey, I'm glad you're enjoying the content, man. All right, let's get up on top here. Fling around downrange and we should be good to go. I feel like that went pretty well, guys. What do you think? Well, let's let's get the mission done, then we'll, then we'll talk about it. <laughs> Get the mission done first, then we'll talk about it. Two hundred. That wind's going, dude. Two seven five. Shit, it's one of ours. Search the perimeter. Now we just gotta get the hell out of here. Oh shit, it's one of ours. So now, Fight. now they're starting to find the bodies of the dudes we dropped. But I don't think they know where I am. Shipping from Russia. Handwritten notes from David mentioned the flow stuff. One of the heads of our double headed snake. Yeah. David and Thomas. Biggest, baddest separatist leaders. Slithering around a lethal cell that should be named Cancer. So who's Flostov? Russian? Right. Some scientist. Now here's the really interesting part. As soon as Flostov's name came up, Mossad came down on us hard. Seems they're also looking for this guy. 
Is Mossad going to be a help or a hindrance here? That's what you're going to find out, John. You've got a meet and greet in a nearby region. Somewhat neutral territory, if any place in this godforsaken area is neutral. I'll see what's up. Is there anything more I should know? No, John. Sorry. No further intel on Robert. Jesus Christ, where is he? Knowing him, he's hiding in plain sight, the sneaky bastard. He's good at what he does. And that's what will keep him alive. I'm doing everything I can, John. I'll be playing the contracts games after this, yeah? priority is analyzing everything we got on David and Thomas Let's Cinematica. You go get the lowdown on this flow stuff. And try to play nice with the Masada. Only if Masad plays nice with me. Out. Uh, so I'm using the, uh, I think it's the M110, but I forgot what they call it in this game. Uh, let's get back to base. Let's see if we got any new, uh, weapon upgrades. Yeah, so I'm using the Knight 110. Uh, I, I like this one because the follow-up shots, like, follow-up shooting, especially in, in a game like this, if you're using bolt action, generally if you miss... You gotta rack the bolt and it takes a good, you know, second and a half or two seconds to be able to get that next round down range. With this, it's like you miss, you can immediately put another round down range, which I which I like. Let me see, do we get any optics for this yet? Still nothing. Uh we got another new handgun. Let's keep the one we got, though. Save the money. It's not much of an upgrade, so it is what it is. Oh, there is. So people ask me, they're like, oh, drone upgrades. There is drone upgrades. Look at this night vision. Uh, we can throw on luring. Look at that. AP rounds. Grab a, we'll grab a handful of these AP rounds. Okay, so we're still doing, we're doing good on ammo. All right, that went well, guys. That that mission went pretty well. Let's see. Um, I wanted to see what it was like to clear one. If you can clear one of these outposts, I don't. No, that was the one we already did. Let's see what they got to say. <clears throat> All right, meet the team. You need to travel to the nearby mountains to meet my entire team and plan our next move. We'll see what they got to say. Cool, man. How you doing? And uh, Mali Boba, what's going on? Yeah, so ma mainly my setup is we got the uh, the Knight 110, got the AK, it's my when shit hits the fan, and I really, and then we got our our handgun. So we got we got a good spread of weapons. Yeah, this is far. Let me check the map real quick. I can fast shovel here. Uh, so this game is called Sniper Ghost Warrior 3.
I love this game. This game is dope as hell, man. It really is. I love the open approach that it has. It, that, that's like the best thing uh, for games like this is uh, when you can kind of go about doing the missions however you want. That's what I love so much about like the Ghost Recon games. You know, if you wanted to play that far away sniper gameplay, you could. If you wanted to go in and just guns ablaze, and you could. You know, if you wanted to use explosives or just go straight stealth, like that. That's what I love about these kind of games. Um, the open world, like military games, is just when you have that choice to kind of approach the missions how you want to approach them. You know, you could be a sniper, you could be a ghost, or you could be a warrior, chat. I feel like we got a little bit of a mix between a sniper and a ghost going right now. Not so much a warrior. Impressive work, Mr. North. What the? I've been tracking your movements. Excuse me? What? Oh, there's different areas? I thought the whole game was going to take place in that area we were just in. Okay. That's pretty dope, chat. Okay, out. Was that a joke? So there's multiple regions, chat. What? It's just getting better and better. Yeah, we played Detroit Become Human on channel. I absolutely love that game. kind of skills are there so there, there's um okay, actually i'm gonna check and see if i actually got some points um so there's sniper skills ghost skills and warrior skills uh let me actually see here this is holding breath 50 percent longer while aiming loot sense um an extra drone slot I kind of want to save up for that too. So we'll do that. I'm going to wait and get some points for that there. the point of that being that shit. So if we don't act quickly. About damn time, John. John North. I'm pleased to finally meet you in the flesh. It's nice to finally put a face to the voice. Likewise, Mr. North. But Other you're more magnetic the... on the radio, to be honest. Jill Valentine outfit on. Lydia. Right? Ex-Georgian SFB. Hmm. So, why are you helping us? Mr. Sims has brought me up to speed on your fight against the Separatists. I believe we can serve each other's interests. I'm looking for a man. He's a high-priority target for Mossad. Who? Dr. Sergei Flostov. If you help me locate him, I will assist you in your efforts against the Separatists. 
as well as in other activities. You have yourself a deal. What's the plan, Frank? If we can eliminate the leadership of these cells while they're disorganized, they'll eventually collapse under their own weight. It's not a walk in the park, however. Thomas Sidamonica and Ina Zakarayan are the leaders of the two strongest separatist Sin cells operating in Georgia. They're also about to be wed. If they manage to merge their forces, the separatists will become a real threat to the sitting government. So, we pop one of them and make it look like a setup, let them take each other out after. You read my mind. JSOC has already signed off on neutralizing Sidamonica. But where? The wedding is being held in Kozori in two days' time. I grew up near Kozori. I could sketch a city map. Good. You go on ahead and find a spot to scope the target. I'm on it. It's a wedding, so make sure there's a clear line of sight of the church. I know I can trust you, Lydia. Keep an open comm channel. Got it. Tick tock. Of course, Mr. North. Are we about to kill somebody at a wedding? Yeah, this is where it's at, chat. Look at this. One thing we've gained any new, uh... I don't think we've gained any new weapons, right? No. Buying your disguise, Lydia? You okay? Somewhat of a minor hero, actually. Dishonorable discharge from the Georgian army goes a long way here. So what exactly did you do? Put a general out of commission along with a dozen Georgian soldiers. Fucking looters and savages. The separatists don't know that, just my kill count. You'd do well to sell some cigarettes or oxy. Any pills you can get your hands on, Lydia. Everyone's got a side hustle going. War is good for business. And business is a great disguise. I'm doing just fine, Raquel. Thank you very much. I'll call when I need advice. So, the winery is a criminal enterprise. Of course. Criminal gangs are expanding rapidly. Everything is for sale. Politicians are in on it. Everyone... Excuse me, Raquel. Let's get back to it. Take out the guards, John. We have our people amongst the workers. They say one of the drivers always leaves his keys in one of the rooms at the top floor. How about some clothes? You'll find it in one of the rooms on the same floor. Thanks. I just got the gone. information that the leader of that crypt- Whoa. Whoa, what happened? Hudson, no way, dude. So Hudson just dropped 50 gifted on the channel, dude. That is rid Everybody received one of those memberships. Hey, welcome to the family. Make sure you get those hearts in the chat. Hudson, that is too much, brother. You've done too much. You are on what I like to call, my friend, donation probation which means you've hit a threshold all right with 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 the channel lifetime of too much all right you you you've, you've hit that threshold and you're on probation dude <laughs> hudzel is on donation probation chat until we see uh, say otherwise, which I've never let anybody off probation, man. Once you hit it, that's it, dude. <laughs> Seriously, brother, I really appreciate the love, man. You really don't understand how much that means to me um, and the fam, dude. It, 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 you're locked up, dude. You're on probation, dude. Seriously, though, thank you, man. I, that you don't understand how kind that is. Criminal 
group is in the winery right now. So if you're feeling somewhat heroic today, you could take him down while you're there. Yeah, so help our cause. I'll do it. Not directly, but the workers will definitely appreciate the change in management. Got it. Okay, so sh two targets. We can take down the criminal leader here in the, uh, the winery. Let's get some... Uh... Holy shit, dude. Let's get some... Uh... Recon going. See, Chad, that's the thing is reconnaissance, I feel like, is such an underappreciated thing. Let me see. Let me see them W's in the chat. If you guys would have just went in here guns blazing. Like, if you're just like, fuck recon, dude, I'm shooting everybody in the face. Just no suppressor. Just going in there, blah, 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 like, like with, a, with a LMG or something. Look at all the savages in the chat. I always, I'm always so surprised because I, I feel like a lot more people play running gun, and especially in shooters, than stealth. And then I'm always so surprised, like. You generally, people who run do run and gun don't like watching people play like me. Like they get really bored. So I'm surprised. Like, how do, how do you those of you run and gun players? How do you how do you stand to watch me play in these games all slow and shit? Now right, we can hop the wall right there and make our way in, bypass that gate. I like to play stealthy until I get caught. And then once I'm caught, then I then I go off, you know what I mean? <laughs> Sham Zero said, I thought we were all stealth archers here, bro. What's going on, dude? Yeah, I enjoy both, too. I feel like there's a time for both, you know what I mean? I don't, uh, like I said, I generally try to go the stealth approach for the most part until, you know, like right now, I got this big stealth plan. And then once this fails and I get, and I get caught, then I'm going to kill everybody. <laughs> Scotty says, I have patience vicariously through you. <laughs> So here, everything in here is going to pretty much be within probably 50 to 100. So we'll keep our scope doped here at like 100. Oh, bro, I'm going to shot you in the fucking face, dude. <sighs> um, Hal, so you don't choose who you get to take out. Like, the, you'll have an objective, um, but you can choose how you take them out. And there are some additional targets that you can take out if you want. Um, they're like called high-value targets or whatever. I just don't know who's going to snitch, because some of these civilians will fucking snitch on you, dude. Stop fucking boring, Nothing ever happened. 
Hear that chat? Nothing ever happens. Come here, you slut. What? Fucking I'll kill, I'll kill you. Okay, then shut the fuck up and we'll be okay. Listen. Help. Fuck me, man. It's all her fucking fault, dude. Reporting casualty. Enemy must be nearby. Search the perimeter. I saved her ass from being... Whatever, dude. knock people out I don't know she just kept talking shit so I, I had it I had to quiet her make her be quiet I didn't want to do it Chad. it's not like you know like I wanted to fucking kill her but she just wouldn't shut the hell up what else was I supposed to do City's heavily guarded, remember? Need to hide my equipment. Or your cover will be compromised. Gotcha. Wait, they want me going in without any weapons?
See if there's a knockout option when you get close to him. Uh, I'll try that next time before just shooting him. I didn't kill her. I, I shot her in like the shoulder or something like that. Right? Gut shot her. No, I. You guys are exaggerating. I didn't shoot her. I didn't even shoot her close to center mass. I've hit my equipment. I'll be in Kazori in a few minutes. That's what I wanted to hear. So, what do I got left? A fucking rock, dude. She was she was compromising the mission. What? Where are you going? What do you have here? Wine? For the wedding? And I'm late. You see? Oh yeah, we were expecting the delivery. But we didn't expect it to be delivered by an American. Why is this? He seems to be telling the truth. There's a lot of wine in the truck. No sign of anything suspicious. Mm. Okay, you can drive in. We're in there, baby. Here with the wine truck. Got it. Take a bottle and meet me in the restaurant. Groom arrived yet? The guy is first on the scene. I'm here to do a job. That doesn't mean talking. I thought we patched things over. I fucking waited for you. I'm a shithead. An asshole. A fucked up piece of scum. Right on all counts. I didn't deserve you. I couldn't... Oh, spare me. It's the truth. So you disappear? You leave me waiting like a lovesick fool? Twelve of my men died that night, Lydia. I remember every name, every face, my whole MEU. Soldiers died, John. We know the risks. It's not your fault. It was on my watch. Stop. I'm way too fucking mad to feel sorry for you. So they pin a medal on me to cover up that massive intel failure. It was a lie. It made everything about me a lie. How could I look anyone, you, in the face? I was going to ask you to marry me. Fuck you, John. 
I would have said yes. Yeah. Well, shit. Hey, wake up. We have a job to do. Ah, shit. We overslept. The streets are probably already crawling with soldiers. You're here as a civilian, remember? They won't recognize you. Maybe... Oh, what an optimist. Either way, I'll still need a weapon to kill the target, and I doubt they'll give me one of theirs. Don't worry. I'm not gonna try to kill anyone in the middle of a church. It's best we strike tonight, while they're drunk and disorganized. I remember so, what do I gotta... I gotta improvise, chat? Cause yeah, I got, I got a, we got no weapons whatsoever. Like we're on some Assassin's Creed type shit right now. Oh lady, let me borrow that broom. Cute too then. We could have, we could have snapped it and used it as a spear, you know? Shot him right in the church. I'm glad the character that we're playing as has better moral compass than I do. Must not know, Chad. We play Assassin's Creed. We've assassinated people right in the middle of motherfucking sermons. Drop down. Like that preacher dude, we would assassinate the fuck out of him. Dearly beloved, we are gathered together here in the sight of God and in the face of this company to join together this man and this woman in holy matrimony. For Georgia! Burn in hell, monster! Like that. Come on, come on. Get your American ass out of here. But I... Shut up. I know a cave just south of here. Get out or be suspect number one. See, like, like that right there, you know, that, that's how we would have done it. Where's the corpse? Okay, I'm sending John. The body is in HQ, just a few guards. Most of the separatists are gathered in the restaurant, where the cell leaders are busy accusing one another. Ina is gone. This should give us some time to investigate. We need to know who that other sniper was. Fuck. They're here. Persistent little fuckers. Half of the city is looking for that motherfucker. We will find him sooner or later. What if there is more of them? I don't care how many people are responsible for this. I just want to find them and kill them. My AK doesn't have a suppressor on it. Seems clear to me. Yeah. I will report it to HQ. You continue searching just in case. Okay. Team 7 here. Yeah, the cave seems empty. Some punks put graffiti all over it, but we didn't notice anything suspicious beside that. Mm. Okay. What? We have to stay and guard the entrance to the cave. 
Fuck, sometimes I hate this job. Stop complaining and move your ass. I don't have any of my uh, gear. <clears throat> All right, they're down. Nice. Just remember that we don't want to start an open war here. We can't afford to have civilians caught in the crossfire. I won't make false promises. Not to you. That's sweet, but just be careful. Oh, holy hell is breaking out. Interrupt your wedding cause quite a ruckus. Yeah, groom's brains plat all over a church tends to do that. What's next, Chief? We're still untangling the encrypted satellite comms. Coming through for juicy details. Robert? Not yet. Fuck. There's a lot of separatist ch what gun do I have about right an elite now? unit operating in the area. Lots of warnings to avoid getting in their way. I've heard a few nervous whispers. No one seems to know their objective. They're like ghosts, inspiring terror and then vanishing again. We've only got one name. A mystery man named Armazi. Spoken of rarely and only with dread. <laughs> like the guy has superpowers. Robert was captured by an elite unit. Could these guys be connected? God, I hope not. They're the worst of the worst. Fuck. Yeah. Out. What else can I expect in the HQ? If they manage to make any notes on the assassination, it should be on one of their hard drives. Got it. Is this where this came from? Yep. Here. And here. There. We can't cover such I'm inside. The body should be in the basement lab. Hey, Raptor. One thing to mind. A couple hundred people. I'll talk with Adam. Familiar with the area. Great. Now, the northern part is presenting a bigger problem. We're on the ground patrols and at least two vehicles. There's no other option. I see him. Anything peculiar? The bullet nearly ripped his head off. 50 cal? Maybe. I won't learn much here. Agent 47 style, baby. Couple hundred people. I'll talk with Atlantic. Now, the northern part is presenting a bigger problem. We only ground patrols and at least two vehicles. No other I found autopsy notes.
I've got the ballistic report. I'm sending you the data. That's it. Get back. No. One more stop. I want to check the church. <laughs> Weird moment for conversion, but suit yourself. This is where this came from? Yep. Here. And here. Okay. We can come to the second of the day. There are just a few available paths in the southern section. I don't even think I, yeah, we don't even have our drone. According to the documents from the autopsy, the bullet was strange and deformed. Strange how? No details. So better off going through the side entrance. We've got two guards on all the entrances right now. Good thing I didn't take that shot. I didn't even see that dude. Yeah, so you could have flanked around, actually. Those dudes probably went, like, around the other side, came up around this back. Let's see how you can get inside. <coughs> so you could probably get in without worrying about <coughs> clearing the area. Bullet hit him like a sledgehammer. Threw him all the way here.
There's a bullet hole in the floor. This is the... Did he shot through the wall? I found a fresh hole in the wall. Two inches thick. That's crazy. Do you know a bullet that could do that? Some 50 cals could. Or maybe Teflon bullets. It had to be a damn good rifle. What can you see outside? Fields, hills, forest ruins. At least a dozen decent sniping spots. Okay. If I were to take a shot like up that, there. I'd choose this ruined church on the hill. Shit. I already know how this went. I'm going to the church. <sighs> Go on then. Let's see what's the best route. Got a vehicle down here that we can use. I feel like this is that church up there. Maybe it's not. No, it's false shorts right here, I think. Or no, right here. Okay. Okay, the meeting is over. The separatists are back on the streets. Keep me informed. Didn't they do the same thing in that movie Shooter? Was it Shooter? Where there was like that assassination and then they had the guy like show him how he would have done it and then they somehow like framed him for it or some shit? I don't remember. It's a dope ass movie though. Mark Wahlberg. Maybe I'm thinking of a different movie. I don't know. I feel like that was it, one of them. I'm at the church on the hill. Look around carefully. If this really was his sniping spot, then he must have left something. Anything. I've been doing this my whole life. Trust me. I know what to do. There is some commotion by the church. Think they might have found what we did. I'll hurry up. Don't worry. What did I do? I didn't do anything. I just killed. Well, I did kill two guys and throw their bodies off cliffs, but that's really not that big of a deal, right? There it is. man really just leave his brass I found the casing and never seen anything like it I think he left it here on purpose he took the shot from this spot quite a rifle he must have clearly a pro how do you know he must have been here at least seven hours laying on the ground waiting no trace of piss or excrement nothing He's special ops, but luckily I found a trail. I'm going after him. Negative. Separatists are on their way. There's no time. 
I'm going, Lydia. Okay, I see a glint. Reflection. Package on a tombstone. Careful. Bomb? Roundish. Odd. Ghosts? Shit, it's a helmet. I... I think. What? It's cool as fuck looking. A helmet is a helmet. Amazing technology. Not sure how it works. If you wanted me dead, I would be. It's a message. The ghost is real, Lydia. And steps ahead of us. Where are you hiding, brother? Is it that hard? I can see you! I see you picked up some new tricks! You give up? Not today. Oh man, how did you even... Fine. Walk straight into a trap, but I'm fine. You need to get out. The separatists are coming. I'm on my way. There it is. 100% sniper rifle accuracy. <laughs> the longest shot, one meter. <laughs> oh, one meter. So guys. the name on the helmet is Amazi, and some damn super sniper shoots it out of my hands. It makes no fucking sense. JSOC is still trying to get a handle on him. All I know is that whispers of this Amazi guy has grown into this crazy urban legend. Some people say he's a part machine. Some say he's like the reincarnation of the ancient pagan god, Mithras. Ah, bullshit. He may be extraordinarily well-trained, but he's a soldier. Just using ultra-high-tech weaponry is all. I've collected one of his bullets. Nothing I've ever seen before. I got a guy. Glad to hear it. Shut up. A guy who specializes in out-of-the-ordinary weaponry. Experimental, cutting-edge stuff. I'll show it to him. See what he has to say. Much appreciated. He hasn't been seen in a while. He tends to disappear like fucking asshole men do. 
Okay, Lydia. Can you track him down? I've got an idea or two. Out. Let's get back to base camp. See what we got going for us now. We actually have a uh, a target here in this town. Um, no, let me let me go get my yeah loadout change real quick. We'll get our gear back. Get my drone back. So that's a new rifle right there. It's a starter rifle. So this is the one I've been using. Uh, we got the Archer T80 and then the BMT03. No, I still like I still like the one we have, guys. It's all around just good. AK, we'll switch this over to this. We got a new knife, the Raptor 2. Night vision. Science of repair kits. Oh, we unlocked medium armor, too. All right, nice. All right, we're looking good, guys. We're looking good. Got our kit back. We're gonna go hunt this target here. So this target is Amin Nabiev. Thirty-three years old. Quite young. My age. Oh well, my kid, I'm older than him. I'm 34, chat. He's a baby in comparison to me. It's the wee baby. All right, Dodge, do your thing, brother. Oh, your mom's at the hospital, brother? Hey, definitely go do your thing, man. Make sure she's good. This way. Shit. 
Shit, I didn't put a suppressor on my AK. Fifty. The wind's at our back, so we don't have to worry too much about it. That's our target building, right? I'm pretty positive. That's target building. No eyes on the target. It's hoping I'd see him through this window and be able to just pop. There he is, I see him. So that was him. I, I thought I saw something, but I couldn't tell. Standing right here. Why isn't he rendered right now? Target eliminated. Oh, you guys are like, oh, loot them. Well, the issue is if depends on how many baddies are here at the building. Light armor, nothing great on this dude. It's a pretty big chest, though. Should unlock her over here. So let's head back to base real quick. I gotta change up my gear. Got a side op over there. We can go check. So we'll throw the silencer on here. Man, we need to get our hands on some freaking better assault rifles with, like, 
suppressors and optics. Preferably. Oh, yeah, we can get this bigger mag now. It's 4K, but we can afford it. All right, so we're going to head over. We'll, we'll hit this. I got to go to this point, and then we'll drive. Uh, I, I thought, I, I, in my head, I was thinking, yo, is the sniper his brother? But, uh... I don't know, it doesn't seem like it would make a whole lot of sense. Why they wouldn't just meet up. Mr. North, they took Sviad. He said he was on the verge of a major discovery. Please save him. Okay. Sviad was caught red-handed in the middle of a sabotage. Well, that's what you get when you work with amateurs. They're a civilian militia trying to defend their homeland. Of course they're amateurs. It's just... I thought they were supposed to be supporting us, not the other way around. Do you think we'd risk someone as valuable as you if we weren't critical? Yeah, yeah. You're the best we have. Sviad Ingarofa is about the best they have. He managed to get some vital intel on a new separatist initiative. Could be a game changer. Go get him. So where is he? Old water mill at the foot of the mountains. Out. He was kind of an asshole, man. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Got elevation up on the road there. Let's see what we can see from here. Okay, not bad sight lines here. Definitely looks like there's a good bit of enemies though.
I just recorded my uh, State of Decay episode uh, this morning. I just got to edit it and upload it. I was going to try to get it up tomorrow for you guys. So I was trying to do, I was trying to line up the, the double shot and completely disregarded the fact that there may be people in the buildings. That's what happens, Sam, when you get complacent. If a zombie apocalypse pops off tomorrow with long range rifle, am I rocking? Ah, oh, dude. I'm more worried about like where, I, where I'm gonna get the toilet paper at. <laughs> I'm more worried about that TP. Okay, so we're gonna. Take out that other guy up top again, and then I'm actually gonna try to scout in the bit in the buildings. It's a guy we got to rescue, right? Looks like it.
I get that good sleep like yesterday. This place makes my skin crawl. And watch your that '70s show. No shit, I have. I heard stories. Stories like ghost stories. There was a girl, you know. She used to live here, a young and hot one. And she got pregnant by a monster called Charlie. There's a guy. Kill all the guards so I can escape safely. Really, bro? I just fucking. Can you hear me now? Why don't you relax, have your McFlurry, and watch it that 70s show? Just chill out. <laughs> Get on the road to feeling much better. Is this? Oh, is it under the stairs? There it is. Your 
you're free. Get the hell out of here. Oh, God bless you. Could you help me find my stuff, please? Yeah, yeah, just go. I will bring it to you. Oh, well, those juggernaut dudes, those real, real big guys, takes two shots. We shot the mask off, and then, then we were able to hit him in the head after the fact. Thank you, Mr. North. Thank you. God bless you. Just be careful, right? Seventy-two percent. So here's the game changer. Separatists got their hands on a stockpile of cruise missiles. Enough to blow up all inbound roads, tunnels, and bridges. All routes connecting the region. Where the hell is it? Don't know. But deployment will effectively cut the region off from any outside help. And trap all area civilians. Yeah, like shooting fish in a barrel. Sviat is on it, tracking the missiles. We'll link you up when we have the location. He may be able to take care of it himself. Or not. Let's hope the cruise missiles don't become an issue. Alright, let's get back to base. See if we can get some more unlocks going. So I didn't I didn't get anything from that, right? No. So, oh, shit. Hey, Stefan, thank you. What's going on? Thank you so much for the super chat. Yeah, Arma. Yeah, that was a good time, man. That was a good time. No, I, there's a lot. Oh, excuse me. There's a lot to be played there still, like tons. Um, And like even like mods and stuff like that. Uh, I think the only reason why we really even cut down on playing it was because uh, the viewership started to die off a bit and we just had so much other shit left. I'm really concerned, Frank. Avaz has gone missing. Intel says there's a deal going down between the criminal gang leaders and the separatists in some medieval ruins. In the mountains? Yeah. That would probably be the ancient church of St. Simon. Now, mostly a collection of boulders and broken carvings. But Avas won't be a part of any deal or any meeting. Because? Too much integrity. He's a real patriot. Love to see he more Arma gameplay. The They're using his name. We're using him. Someone in the meeting must know more. I know those mountains from childhood. I'll stay in touch with John. If they have Avas, it's against his will. Be careful. Out. Yeah, so far, equipment-wise, I'm really, really happy with my sniper rifle. The only weapon that we really need to get a better version of is our assault rifle. Our main, like, weapon when shit hits the fan. The AK's okay, but... 
Even if we just get an optic for the AK, I'll probably feel a lot better about it. Target here. Might as well hit him, right? A lot of enemies in this area. Take this guy. He got a shot off. Did nobody really hear it? Anderson, what's up, brother? How you doing? work right now I'm, I, I'm having a great time with this game dude it's it's legit like if ghost recon wildlands and far cry had a baby that's how somebody broke it down i was like dude that's like the perfect way to explain this game that's exactly what it feels like skill points uh we oh we got the four so we can get our no oh, yeah 
And then we got two here. We need four for that. I love Ghost Recon Wildlands. It's probably one of my favorite uh, mil like, military shooters like ever. It, it's, it's pretty awesome. Breakpoint was up there too if you play it on the immersive mode. Um, Breakpoint's pretty good too. Don't raise any alarms. So I don't know. I don't. I don't think that's optional, chat. But you guys know me. I don't know if I ever raise the alarm. Uh, steep cliffs. Can't say I don't enjoy a challenge. There's no shooters around. Nobody on the path. Your heading your way. Better take cover. You know, I rather like you when you're angry. Uh, like before the wedding? Don't count on it happening again. I think I got it out of my system. Ah, good. Yeah, all the better to focus on Amazi. I don't get why he let me live. He had a perfect shot. Uh, Wait, he busted him cheeks? Mistake. People do make mistakes, you know? Georgian proverb. The tall one wouldn't bend, the short one wouldn't stretch. Wait, so he busted him cheeks? <sighs> no, Chaz, she... She was pretty mad. <clears throat> this dude gets no chicks. Wrangled the hams. <laughs> what does that even mean, dude? Just 
She was so mad, I was pretty sure he, he, he was getting no play. Come on, dude, really? The game's not going to do me like this, right? Come on. Come on, not like this. Just don't do me like this. Come on, go. Thank you. Thank you. Please, chat, that's all it takes. It's got to let the game know that not to do it. And, the, and the, see how it just didn't do it? Already here, but thanks for the intel anyway. seem cheerful. What's wrong? Take a look at the Separatist commander. Should I know him? His name is Boris Dragonin, former Air Force lieutenant involved in the Kosovo massacre. He's in our deck. Most wanted. Do the world a favor, John, and take down that scum. We'll see. Remember, first we need to see what's going on. Try to overhear their conversation, will you? Assume you brought the drugs and cash. Sure. You have the weapons? Yes. Where is Abbas? That's not your concern. We can still do business. Answer me before I call Amazi. No, no. We don't need to drag 23 society into this. Abbas retired. Vasilisk is running his operations now. Hmm. Proceed with the exchange. Yes, yes. Of course. Okay. Let's get this moving, people. I need to make a call. And what were they talking about? I was too general. I think they were discussing business.
It's done. Yes. I see. He wasn't happy. No, no threats. I'm not sure. What the? Amazi, tell me what you know. Uh, I never talked with him. He and his 23 society goons just took the gear from Vasilisk and left. That's all I know. That's all I want to know. In Devos. Vasilisk has him in the quarry. Is he alive? Yes. Vasilisk has him. Pretends Avas still runs the business. I better find him in one piece. Fuck! What happened? John, did you find something? Avas is at the quarry imprisoned by Vasilisk. You sure? Yeah. This little fucker here spilled all the beans. So how do you I don't, I don't, how do you change your ammo type like this? Let's see, I think I have some AP. Yep. Lieutenant Driven in is down. Good job. You made the world a slightly better place. <laughs> Fuck, dude. They're putting rounds down range on me, dude. Yeah, escalated very quickly. Wasn't a clean, like, I, I shot him, like, fucking damn near point blank, you know what I mean? So trying to get away at that point without getting seen was highly unlikely. I should have took the shot from further away, but it is what it is. Zip line here somewhere. Look, well, we Abbas the new has been dethroned. Seems like that bastard Vasilis got impatient to take the reins. Is Abbas still in the quarry? He's unhurt, is he? I'll go do some recon. Great. Out. Wait. What? Zara mentioned this group, 23 Society. Keeps coming up. You know anything about these guys, Frank? Yeah. Kind of an intelligence community in-joke. Crazy conspiracy theory. Anything goes wrong, an intel guys blame it on 23 Society. Like, 
the boogeyman. But Zara, big bad dude, says he met with them. Says he met Amazi. Looked like he was going to piss his pants just saying the name. Zara is batshit crazy. I wouldn't trust a word he says. Out. Yeah, I so feel like wanted me to relay his thanks for saving his life. They're not telling me something, dude. Doesn't it seem like the plan? Or... You should have all the details on your laptop. Please, Mr. North, hurry. Like they keep trying to avoid like every time it's brought up. Just oh no, yeah, disregard that. Like oh, it's a bunch of bullshit. Like what? I feel like they're feeding me a bunch of bullshit. So we got this handgun here. Wow, this thing is a monster. All right, so we'll get this. Suppress it. Throw a light on it. Keep hitting the wrong damn button. Got some mines, not working on that. And this. Mm, got a new scope here, which goes 6, 12, and 24. That is a monster scope, dude. Hell yes. Repair this. Yeah, that's, a, that's, a, that's a pretty big scope. Kind of want to try this bow out. What do you think, guys? Get our crisis going. The only thing that's going to suck is if we get into a firefight. Uh, I can actually craft up some barbed head arrows. We'll try it. Why not? Oh, I didn't grab ammo. How does the aim markers go on this yellow, green, red? Can anybody explain? Oh, get, somebody explain. What is the distance markers? Does anybody know? Ugh. 30, 40, 50. Green is close, red is far. All right, we'll play around it. We'll, we'll try to figure it out. Let's see here. Ah, uh, check on the computer. We'll give her a go. So we got the burning bridges. Oh, we could do this. Missiles are in place. Location confirmed. I told you Sviad was good. He tracked him to an old Georgian base in the mountains. Just north of where you rescued him. 
So he's going to infiltrate the site and disable the missiles? Very funny, Marine. That's above his pay grade. That's what I thought. No harm in asking. So? Heavily guarded and on high alert after the shit we pulled with Zviad? Yep. Firing would shatter the region. Then it's game over. Be careful, John. That was quite far, actually. Uh, let's see. I got a fast travel here. Military base here. All right, we're going to figure out how the hell we're going to infiltrate this. Jesus Christ. Looks like the ladder's been knocked down there. I think we gotta play all those rocks right there. It looks like a, a way in. That rock face. Brent, thank you so much for the membership. Welcome to the fam. How you doing tonight? We gotta keep going up, right? Is this as high as we can go? So we can't get there from here. Up, oh, right there. <coughs> Just like that, baby, we are in. I'm in the base, Frank. There are four missiles here, for fuck's sake. Right. Get rid of him. 
Bitch, you're supposed to go goodbye. Get rid of him. For real this... Any suggestions for new content creators? Uh, it all depends on... I mean, I always tell people the same stuff, you know, like consistency. And uh, make sure you're doing it for the right reasons are like the big things I actually tell people. But uh, it all kind of depends on like what you what you need help with. Um, I think a big thing that a lot of guys do is they try to just imitate what they see other people doing. And... Um, then they wonder why it doesn't work because you know people want you if everybody just did the same thing you know what i mean most people are just going to gravitate to the biggest guy who's been doing it the longest and then do it that that does, that does it the best so you got to kind of try to find something that's going to make you unique and make people want to watch you over anybody else and uh patience man time and patience it takes fucking forever dude i've been doing this shit for Four and a half years. <laughs> you know, people think that, oh, you know, I got a good, I got the best computer. Like, people literally will go out and spend five grand on a computer. They're like, I got the best computer on the market, so I'm going to start recording videos and everybody's going to watch it. And, it's just like, and then they go, they record videos, and then nobody watches it. Get no views or one or two views, and then they freak out. Like, what the hell? Like, why isn't this working? And it's like, because it, like, Good hardware isn't the answer. Like you can, there's guys that get millions of views that have fucking that do it on their damn cell phones. Oh no, dude! No way, bro. We were stuck like Chuck Chad, but we got out, baby. George, what's up, brother? How you doing? Oh, I forgot about the bow. I forgot about the bow, dude. This handgun is nasty, though. I really like this new handgun. Uploading the virus. Now it's always it's always weird though, because you know people come, they ask me all the time, and uh, I've even had like bigger YouTubers come and ask me, um, you know, like, hey man, like, what do you do? And I'm like, dude, I like, there's no secret to this, you know. I don't like no secret to what I do. I don't have like this hidden plan that I just. Do what my community likes. You know, I try to make my community happy. I try to feed off of the things that you. I think you guys are enjoying, and I just kind of double down on that. And uh, I literally just sit down and play video games, man. That's it. I just focus on the games, the gameplay. I try to not be super cringe, <laughs> and we just game, dude. That that's it.
Hey, 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 listen, I don't I see the Glock Shane in the chat. Listen, I own two Glocks IRL, all right? And they're 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 all right guns. It's not my prize gun. I have a Kimber 1911 that I really, really like, but my Glocks are nice. My EDC is a Glock 48. Virus is coming to the second missile. No, 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 Andy, no, 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 no. Dude, don't, don't, don't go there, Andy. Tries not to be cringy, but will let rip dad jokes that'll make it. My dad joke, my jokes are good, bro. My jokes are good. What the disrespect? Bitch. Damn. <laughs> he just laid down immediately, Jet. He didn't even have to think about it. He just was like, you know what? It is what it is, dude. I mean, let me take this nap. A Glock 19? That's a big gun, man. I Working I, on the third one. I got some, uh, like, etching. Fuck. Fuck, John. They started preparing to launch the last missile. You have 15 minutes to disable it. Get to the command center and start the process of self-destruction. Right. Christ, of course. Um, I got some etching done on my, my Glock 48 on the, like, handle and stuff like not or not actually it's like the grip i had to put the grip on it and um i didn't have it for like two three weeks and in that two three weeks i had to carry a fucking my glock 22 is my everyday clarity and i hate it, it that was such a big gun dude it was annoying i'm like yo how do people carry these full size dude because it was just so uncomfortable So that Open fire. Hit, damn it. God damn. So I tried shooting that guy and I was wondering why he wasn't dying from the bow and arrow is because he was one of the juggernaut dudes. I wanted to try the Glock 19. That's the only Glock I haven't like really held in. People say it's pretty comfortable um, to, like, carry. So, I don't know. I'll try one one day. I still feel like it's a lot of gun. Alright, so let's, uh... Let's not make that same mistake again. Oh, what am I doing? So it said we have 15 minutes, but I don't see a timer, chat. 
think they're fibbing. I appreciate you, Nanya. Seriously. Got a high point? Yeah, what's wrong? So, Chad, I don't know a whole lot about handguns, right? I came up in the military. I used a lot of military stuff. Um, I know high point is like the meme of handguns, though. Like, why? Is it like a bad brand or something? Because uh, I did see, I seen a high point at the gun shop uh, a couple weeks ago. And, uh... Yeah, it was like a fucking $200 handgun. I'm like, what, dude? That's so cheap, bro. Even like my Glock 48 was still like 400 bucks. Dude, 19X has a 19 plus 1 capacity. Right now, like swimmer, baby. Just whoop through the front door. behind the couch there's no way they'll ever find us run with the super chat thank you so much This couch, dude. Shit, it's one of ours. Locate the shooter. Oh, shit, it's one of ours. Gonna wait. Yeah, I wanted to buy a um a twenty two caliber pistol just to kind of mess around with. Um, because the ammo's cheap and uh it's just fun and uh they had a bunch of like little revolvers that you know you could fill, uh, do 22 and then they had a couple like revolvers that had 22 mag which I've never even fucking heard of before. Uh, but yeah, they're just like these really big 22 rounds and uh he's like I was like do you have any anything like semi-auto not like revolver and he's just like well I got this one he pulls out the fucking high point 22 and then he wanted they were wanted like almost $500 for it. I'm like what? 
like five, almost five hundred dollars for a high point twenty two caliber pistol. I was like, get the fuck out of here, dude. I'm like, I'm good on that. <laughs> I'm good on that, bro. I just wanted it to play around with, you know what I mean? But the gun, it was so expensive for no reason. Like, zone of action go. is clear. Hopefully, they'll go back. Roger. Return to post. We've got hostiles. No, you don't. He seen me. He seen me behind the couch, chat. He seen me behind the couch. <laughs> Nanya with the super chat. Thank you so much. I I appreciate that, man. I appreciate it. I try. I try to do my best, dude. I didn't. There was nothing else I could do, guys. Was I gonna shoot him with my high point? That has to be an easier way to enter this building, because even in that doorway there, I didn't see shit. These dudes here. Okay, so I got my armor piercing rounds in, which means I should be able to delete those big guys. I'm trying to use a supported stance on this, but it won't work. We're under attack. Big guy down. supported right now. Like this ain't a good idea.
Well, FX uh, editing videos is no joke, man. It takes a lot of time. Like a lot of the guys that have been like are really, they just been doing it for a really, really long time, um, or they they hired somebody who's been doing it for a really, really long time. But um, it's just practice, man. The more videos you edit, the edit the better you get. You know, watch YouTube videos on things you could do and just constantly trying to improve yourself oh like you know what i mean you'll you'll just keep getting better and better at it i'm terrible at editing um i do the bare minimum just because i'm so bad at it uh i just do a couple jump cuts and i might throw a fade or two in there but yeah editing is one of those things that kind of just takes time and practice like anything really in the world You know, nobody just woke up and was just super good at editing, you know what I mean? I have not played Helldivers 2. I was actually thinking about try. I almost tried it uh, today, but we got a couple games I want to clean up. I might I might try it in the over the next few days. Maybe. I don't know. Cause I, I'm, I'm, I feel like I bought a lot of games over the past few days. I don't care. That I... Uh, I've only played once and then had to get so just wasted money in my opinion. Let's see if we can lure this dude in here with a rock. Wrong button, wrong button, wrong button. Do something stupid, dude, and I'll fucking drop you, dude. I don't play. We are surrender. Don't shoot us. I'm in the command room. Fine. Find the main computer and start the process of self-destruction. Hurry up. I don't trust them, chat. I don't... I'm unarmed. I'm unarmed. Like, you, you know, it, it's weird because it's like the only person that, like, the only people that say, like, I'm unarmed and, like, don't shoot me are people who are going to do something sus. Like the way he's saying it, just is sus. I don't know. I don't want to fight. I have no weapon. Please. Maybe he's just saying he doesn't have a weapon and he doesn't want to fight. I'm unarmed. I'm unarmed. I don't want to fight. I have no weapon. Please. I'm unarmed. I'm unarmed. Can you knock him out? Uh, let me see. No, I don't have the option. Don't kill me. I think they're just they actually just they just don't want to fight yet. Is this my target? I got a. It looks like there's a target in this building. Who is it? Doctor. Dorana. Oh. Sorry, lady. Why would? Why would they make her the target?
set. She, she was my target, dude. I, I had it. Gotta do what you gotta do. I don't wanna fight. I have no weapon. Please. Set me up, dude. They slept me up. They set me up, dude. We had to do what we had to do, you know what I mean? Uh, somebody asked, what guns do the big guys have? Good question. They have... Ooh. An LMG. That I think I just broke down into pieces instead of fucking looting. I, well, my thing is like when I stream man, I don't necessarily like I do play newer games obviously um, God damn um, I do play newer games, obviously, because, you know, they're, they're newer games and you guys are interested in them. I'm interested in them. But I don't jump on, like, every brand new game just because it's like a hype train. Like, Hell Drivers is not necessarily, like, my style game that I usually play. So that's why I wasn't like, oh, let me play this game. You know what I mean? The only reason why I'd be playing it is because you guys want me to play it. And uh, that'd be pretty much it. Like... Not because, like, it's necessarily something I'm super interested in. I'd literally be playing it because uh, you guys have asked me so much. But it's like a multiplayer game, so I, I, I mainly play a lot of single-player stuff. And I, I've asked people, like, hey, you know, can you play Helldivers 2 single-player? And people will say, yeah, but good luck. <laughs> And I'm like, oh, okay. Well, shit. Get the deck. Okay, so we're we talking 127. But yeah, I mean, I I get burned out really quick on those type of games. Um, like even uh, what was that game? Uh, what the fuck was it called? World War Z. Like I don't even know how people can play that game for more than like two hours because it's just so repetitive. And it's like I don't <clears throat> like it's it's all right, you know what I mean? But I don't <clears throat> enjoy those just like mindless chaotic. Uh, 
like shooters where it's like just these spammy wave after wave after wave after wave and you're just just lighten it up without any like story or context to it it really doesn't do a whole lot for me Like I said it's fun for a couple hours and then I'm I'm, I'm super over it after what the fuck is a sniper at dude? 100 I mean uh so, Crusader, you're not the first person to say that, man. Like, I've had people say, bro, I, I am the same way, but this game is different. I'm like, all right, all right, all right. well, then we'll see then. Liar, dude, no, I'm not. Lost eyes on the target. He's somewhere. God damn. God damn. God damn. <laughs> I wasn't ready for it, chat. I wasn't ready for it. Shit is just kept it moving, dude. But I wanted to try out that the LMG. At the moment, we are not playing Pal World. No, we um we had way too many survival games, and uh, I kind of put it out there: Pal World or Enshrouded, and. The majority of the community chose Enshrouded, so we kept playing Enshrouded over Power World. So my thing is, I, I really do enjoy survival games a lot, but you guys got to remember, I don't enjoy grindy survival games i don't enjoy it like grinding in those games a lot of people do um but the whole grind factor ain't for me that's like that that's where the game loses me that's where the com like the community kind of gets bored after a while when i have to like sit here on stream and put like 20 30 40 hours into grinding I just, it's just not fun content to watch. It's probably different for you as a player, like when you're the one doing it, but when it comes to like watching somebody do it after you've already done it yourself, it, yeah, it's, it's not super, super, super interesting at all. Now, that's the thing about grinding, you know, is there's some hardcore, like, viewers out there that you guys don't care. You, like, they enjoy watching the grind, but I say, like, that's a small percentage of the community. 
So it's like when you, if I, like, say, for instance, we, I use this example with Ark. I go out, say I spend, you know, in a game like Ark, you got to consistently spend like five hours at a time, you know, going out and getting metal. All right. So the first time you guys sit there and watch. The first time you guys sit there and watch me grind metal for four hours. It's cool. You guys are like, oh, yeah, this is good. I, I can get on board with this. Then I do it again. I lost my target. Um, and then people are kind of like, ah, oh, you know, there's some people are just ain't really for me. Oh, fuck, dude. I had to see, I need a rifle, dude. This shit is hard. All right, so we're just going to go back. We're going to fuck open in the gate. We're just going to go back out the way we came in. If that's possible. No, we're going to have to open this gate, set up a perimeter and fight. But I'm going to have to switch over to an AK. Um, But after, like, the first time watching it, people are cool with it. But once it's, like, the third or fourth time, people are just like, all right, dude, yeah. That's where people just start skipping over the content. Like, And I know, I know you guys have done it. You'll be sitting there watching a live stream. And I'll be doing, like mining or something and people just they just skip it they're not trying to watch that shit again i just tried the lmg game over it it's so So I'm gonna grab an AK, and I'm also gonna just clear these dudes out. We're gonna kill everybody around before we open the gate to kind of alleviate the uh, the amount of people that come at us. It was an AK out here, I guess not anymore. Right, let's start wiping these dudes. But yeah, that's one of the hardest things because it, it's it. A lot of people see it as, um, they look at the con. Sometimes they they look at the content the same as like when they did it themselves, not really understanding that like what is fun for you in your house, like when you're kind of just chilling, doing your own thing, doesn't necessarily mean it's fun to like watch. Uh, and a lot of people they don't enjoy grinding. Or like, you know, an arc. Like, who really would want to sit here and watch me breeding dinos for like 30 hours? Maybe like a handful of people, maybe. Jesus Christ. Should have just been patient, but instead I was an idiot. I keep forgetting to uh, adjust for windage. Chat's fun during, but you gotta remember, Patrick, 65% of the people who watch my videos watch them after. So they don't even watch it while it's live. So where chat might be, and so the videos, the live streams, these videos survive based off of the people who watch these after the fact. Not even all of you guys here right now. A series depends on how well that video is gonna perform in video form. So where it's fun for you guys to sit here and interact and bullshit with each other during chat, somebody who's sitting here watching this as a video afterwards, they can't they can't participate in any of that. It's not the same. Um, so it, it that's where the videos don't get watched, and uh, and then we end up losing series. We got to make sure that. Uh, 
Everything we do here on the live can translate into something that is worth watching on the back end, too. Can't get these guys. Hey, what's wrong? You okay? Now, don't get me wrong, there are some games that are so powerful in the live stream, like you guys pop off and we'll have so many people here that that's enough to kind of keep a series going, but a lot of the times it's uh, it's on the back end. I'm hit, damn it. There it is. Now, I don't think we can get back up the way we came in, right? Because it was a pretty good drop. Oh, maybe, 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 maybe. Let me see. I think we can. I just do all this for no reason, chat. Well, we can, see? I didn't even have to do all that. We we could have got back out the way we came in. Be careful. Don't stick your neck up. Just started uh, finished watching the Mafia. Yo, Mafia 2 is so good. Game over. I absolutely love that game. Damn, Balti said, yeah, the back end is important. <laughs> oh, there it is, dude. All right, we got that. Well done, John. Amazing job. Oh, uh, we got a Couldn't new hand done. High praise indeed. The Separatist big plan of cutting off the region is gone. Got loose sense. Get the oh. Bridges, tunnels, and roads are secure. It's a big win, John. You've saved a lot of lives. Civilian and military. Glad to help. Our guy sounded real enthusiastic right there. Ah, oh, Lawrence, I really appreciate it. You, like, you guys don't understand how much that really helps, Lawrence. Like, e even from a financial standpoint, like, when you guys do that for me, it it's huge. It, it is huge. I, there's so many of you guys that literally do, like, you'll go, like, before you leave the house for work or something, you'll just go and, like, throw my live streams up on your computer and fucking take off for the day, you know, and then my streams are just playing, uh, or a playlist is just playing all day. Um, like, that shit really does help, and, um, yeah, I, I tell you guys all the time, like, I, I appreciate, you know, when you guys go out of your way to do something like that for me, it really is awesome. Like that's that's big. That's big support right there. Alright, we gotta switch off of this. I wish we could get a freaking optic and a suppressor for that guys, but we can't. Stuck with this dumbass AK, man. Combination. He's the kind of guy who every time you turn around has exactly what you need. Knife, beer, length of chain, blanket, uncanny. Kind of creepy, actually. So Avas trusts this guy? Avas is no fool. He knows how dangerous Vasilisk is, but he is very useful. Became Avas's right-hand man, despite Vasilisk's little hobby. This just keeps getting better and better. Yeah, he'd throw his enemies in a pit and then cover them in cement. Oh, thanks. I'm so looking forward to meeting this maniac. The bookie can tell you where to find Vasilisk. He's got a lowdown on everything going on at the quarry, but the bookie would sell out his grandmother if the price was right. Don't trust him. 
Don't trust anyone in that godforsaken sinkhole. Hope at least the booze is good. Out. Hey, don't you ain't gotta worry about me, chat. If you raise an alarm, Basilisk may panic and kill him. Okay, so get to the quarry. Don't provoke the criminals. Come on, chat. You know I got this. I appreciate the love, guys. Um, yeah, so we got a ton of that. We got a ton of that. All right, let me just re let me repair my suppressors and stuff. And this one also. <laughs> hey, we said, <laughs> you think we just leave a playlist going when we leave, bro? Hell no. We watching you stream all day. <laughs> I appreciate that, brother. Seriously, man. <laughs> I don't know. I never, I never imagined I, I, that I would be enjoyable enough for people to like walk around listening to me, like, 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 like I'm a a gym workout playlist. You know, people just got me in their ear all day. I feel like I would be sick of me after an hour. <laughs> No, you guys are amazing. I really appreciate it. Like, uh, I can't even explain to you how it makes me feel, guys. It's like this, just, it's so much, uh, it's, uh, it's joy, it's happiness. Like, the fact that, like, me and my content and like what I do here is is actually like important to people like people really like care about it on like a day-to-day -day basis it's just like I, it makes me so happy that I could be there for people and their time of need you know so many of you guys were like hey man I was in a really dark place for a couple months and you know I just was watching your streams and hanging out with you guys in chat and you really helped me and like that shit right there it's just it's it's it, it makes all the shit that, you know, I've gone through, all the hard times, all the bad, like, it makes it all worth it. Like, just something, just just that right there is, is more than enough to make all of this worth it. I played Ghost Recon Playpoint and Wildlands. Uh, I'll be playing the new Division game when it comes out, the uh, the Heartland one. I think that, I think that's the name of it. Uh, but as for going back to like the old ones, I'm not I'm not sure about that. Okay, so he said not to provoke the baddies or the don't provoke the criminals and they won't attack you. Discharge your weapon or enter in a restricted area will turn them hostile, okay. Hey, Pat, you know I appreciate the love, brother. When did this game come out? I think, what was it, 20, 2017? Yeah. 
Then he's going to repeat the tackle. Chat, what do I feel like I've seen this fight animation before? I thought the fight was just gonna repeat, dude. Yo, he actually kicked his ass. That's what's up, dude. Lucky I day. thought it was just gonna go in like a loop. You know how they do that sometimes? They'll just endlessly be fighting. I'm looking for the man at the top, the very top. I'm running a business here. You want my time? You got a bet just like everyone else. Yeah, fine. You're lucky I'm not in the mood to make a scene. Yet. Kick your fighter, place your bet, enjoy your winnings. Hmm. I mean, Vlad the Crusher is the safe bet, but because his name is Vlad the Crusher, I feel like he's about to get his ass kicked. So we'll go with the other guy. But because his name was Vlad the Crusher, I felt like he was about to get schooled. Ooh. Well, my guy got hands, chat. It's the same fight animation, chat. That means my guy's gonna win. That means my guy's gonna win, dude. It was the same fight animation. That's how I knew we were gonna win. Oh, King DT, I appreciate that, man. What? You won. Avery, I hear I've that, played man. you a little game. Now talk. Where can I find Avas? He likes to keep a close eye on the business, you know. Where is Avas? Hell, I honestly have no idea. You like betting, huh? Let's bet on how many punches I give you before you have permanent brain damage. Wait, what? Now you're a big guy. I'm thinking between 30 and 40. Okay, talk with Madame Moon. She runs the brothel and she knows everything about everyone. Tell her I sent you and she won't be afraid to talk. Good. Chat, we're going to the brothel. Keep your minds out the gutter, what okay? I wish I had enough money to go to the brothel. Can't wait to catch them all, huh? What? One word, my friend. What was the one word? Damn, bro, did you leave the brothel walking like that? That's the, it got snapped off walk. Yeah, 
So, how about we go somewhere more private? Hold your titties. I haven't made up my mind yet. What? Did you say hold your titties? <laughs> Nobody says that, dude. <laughs> You feel a bit lonely, monsieur. I know what ails you, and I have the perfect remedy. You'll need a woman. Or two. Take your pick. I'm not interested in that. Bookie told me that you can help me. I'm looking for Avas. Honey, I'll tell you what. I'll set up a meeting with a friend who might know something. In the meantime, why don't you take a break? Relax. Thank you, ma'am, but... You know you want it. There's a bed upstairs, very, very comfy. Find some company and enjoy yourself for a few hours. Where is Avas? There's someone who will know where Avas is. His right hand in business. I'm listening. My girls had a man, known as Vasilisk. He has been talking with some of the boys at the barracks about how old Avas is and ill-suited to lead the business right now. It's not enough. Maybe he knows something about Avas. She knew I was about to start tearing people up. Vlad is going to fight with you. My daughter works at the establishment. She's so lucky to get <laughs> Thank you so much for the super chat. What did you know? Um, okay. Dope, bro. And I wait religiously for your SOD2 vids. Keep up the dope work. Name's short for my name. <laughs> Kuchihara, by the way. Hey, it's all good. It's all good. Uh, I'll probably uh, be releasing another SOD video tomorrow. I got it recorded today. Um, I just got to get it edited and uploaded and hopefully live for you guys tomorrow. That secret container base. Mm. It's over, Vasilisk. Let the old man go. I agree with the American. I really think you should listen to Shut me. up. Okay. Mr. North, how lucky for us to meet again. Drop the weapon. You must be fucking kidding. It was worth a try. It seems you have me in a bit of a spot. So, how about we play a little game? Fuck your games. Jonathan, you don't get it. I'm in control. Now, there are three of us and three rounds in this pistol. If the old man dies, you get to ask me all about Robert North. If you die, the old man walks. And you? I'll be dead. Of course, you could shoot me now and save the old man. But deep down, you want to know about your brother. Don't you? Exactly. Shall we begin? One. Congratulations, old man. You live to annoy another day. Two. That's twice now, Mr. North. Don't you think your luck has to run out sometime? Babois! I'm sorry, but you don't get to play. Three. Grandpa, are you all right? Grandfather? Yes, my dear, yes. I am well. This is your grandfather? Yes. This old bastard is all I have. I'm in your debt, friend. Anything I can do? Name your price. I need to know everything about Vasilisk and the people he's working with. Well, seeing as I am no longer in immediate danger, 
I'll be only too happy to help. But let's get out of here first. I haven't been outside for days. Damn, Chad, that was... That was savage, dude. Small fry, how you doing tonight? Thank you for the 20 months, man. That's absolutely insane. Almost two years, dude. I hope you're having a good night tonight. Small fry, isn't the isn't that picture? What the hell was that guy's name? It wasn't from Aqua Team Hunger First. Pretty sure his name was just like. Fries. Wasn't there a milkshake too, dude too? The big like fucking milkshake. That fry lock. Wasn't there a cup, like a milkshake? I don't know if it was a milkshake or just a fucking cup. Calm down, everyone. Calm down. This man saved my life. He killed, he killed that around the shake and trade of us. Everyone involved in this pathetic little coup will pay with his blood. And as for this man, he's the most honored guest. Most honored guest. Oh, yeah, there was a meatball too, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot about that little the meatball dude. Avas has plenty of questions for Vasilis supporters and intel that will be very useful to us about the coup. But his agenda isn't our agenda. Yeah, well we're not working for fucking Mossad. Even though our interrogation methods are far superior to yours. Even though you weren't fucking born in this region, don't know all the players or the dead personal history here? Save your goddamn superiority for... Easy now. Lydia, you lead, but let Raquel jump in with an assist from time to time. <sighs> Thanks, John. But let's please keep the assistance to a minimum. Well, she gonna oh, watch, huh? You'll break my spine like you did your commanding officer? Accidents happen. Don't fuck up my chance to dig up the intel on Robert. Got it? She's got it. Right, Raquel? Anything you say, John. Out. Going at it, chat. It's because she offered me those extra services and she, she was not happy about that. Like, at all. I didn't see any new gun unlocks after that, but I'm going to check anyways. So we did. We got a shotgun. Yeah, we got a shotgun, that's it. I thought I, yeah, I thought, I, yeah, I unlocked the shotgun. It's all good. Well, all right, guys. It's getting late. We're going to end this here tonight. Uh, again, I really appreciate you all for coming and hanging out. Uh, like I said, game plan will be tomorrow. I I, like, I already recorded that State of Camp episode. I just got to get it edited. I actually might edit it as soon as I end the stream. I think my software is open. Yeah, I could just literally edit it tonight. And then uh, I'll try to upload it first thing in the morning. And then have that going for you guys. I, I, I don't know what I, so have you guys been enjoying the premieres on those or do you guys want me to just release it as like a regular ass video because I know that some people have been having issues with the premieres lagging uh, if you are ever watching the premieres for some reason because you got to remember I upload that as a video on YouTube so it is a, a I don't know why there's lag because it's uploaded uploaded um, but yeah I, I usually do the premieres and let you guys hang out and chat or whatever but i know people have been having playback issues with it um but i don't know i feel like it's youtube people are gonna have playback issues regardless but if you are ever watching the 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 premieres and it's lagging for you you just go back like a minute and um you won't have to worry about it
Oh, yeah, the ads are fucking gross, dude. The ads are so bad on the videos. That's why I didn't. That's why I like doing the premiere because uh, I don't think they show per ads during the premiere, right? You'll you'll you get an ad at the beginning, and then um, at the end, but I don't think you get any ads in during the premiere, right? Compared to if it was a video, I know there'd be fucking ads all over the place. Yeah, it's wicked weird, Anderson. It's so weird, man, with the damn premieres. But I know if you go back like a minute and then just let it flow like there, it, it, it goes pretty good. <laughs> a lot of people. I don't. I don't know, dude. I, I got YouTube. I've had. I mean, the same for me, guys. I've had YouTube Premium for like two years, two and a half years now. All right. Well, I'll just keep. I'll just keep the premieres going for now. Then it seems like it's working. Seems like people are enjoying it. So. All right, guys. Again, thank you. You all have a great rest of your night. Uh, I love you all. I get, appreciate the support. Remember, if you guys want some more Sniper Elite, just smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. Drop a comment down below after the stream ends. It always helps out, guys. I really do appreciate it. Um, and other than that, you guys have a great rest of your night, and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.